watching Fox Rochester. And this is Good Day Rochester. All right, welcome back. Are we doing this Buffalo Bill story now, or are we going to hold on that one? All right, we're going to hold on that one because we want to tell you about the Rock the Park Urban Music Festival. It is happening tonight. We've been talking all morning long about if anyone has an event going on tonight in terms of uh, organizing, boy, did he pick the jackpot weekend to have an event. Uh, Carlton Wilcox is uh, someone who knows a lot about this festival, even will be performing tonight. So thank you for coming in this morning. Uh, we know it's a big day for you, and so appreciate making the time to join us uh, this morning. So the festival as a whole, this sounds like it's going to be an awesome time. Yes, it Tell is. Tell us about it. Well, it's um, Rock the Park. It's a three uh, uh, series of three events, and tonight is our second event. It's the Rhythm and Group R&B Tribute, and we're uh, featuring some of the best talent from Rochester, Buffalo, and Syracuse, and we're going to uh, celebrate the great music we know as R&B. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And tell us R&B, because, I mean, we say R&B, and you kind of think about some tunes in your head, but tell us about the genre. How do you perceive it? Oh, tonight we're going to focus on, um, like, 90s, 80s, 90s R&B, um, some great groups like Boys to Men. Um, we're going to do, uh, wow, it's just a lot of stuff. We're going to go from Boys to Men to Sam and Dave <laughs> to um, Nino and Vince, I believe is his name. Uh -huh. We're going to do a lot of that stuff. Uh-huh. Boys to Men. <laughs> Nico and Vince, they were just here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Boys to Men, my childhood. <laughs> You don't mind if we all sing along, even if we can't carry Absolutely. a tune at all. <laughs> I mean, Absolutely. I mean, like at all. Just join right in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so you'll be playing bass, right? Yes, I will be. With which group? I'll be playing bass with a, a dynamic duo, Nate and Renee Anderson. Uh huh. Mm. And well, they'll be performing for they'll us. They'll be performing today. Uh, in about 20 minutes, which is impressive. As a musician, Oftentimes, I imagine the gigs and performances are in the evening. Is it? And then we call up and say, "Hey, do you want to perform for us at 8:50 in the morning?" Is that is that a tough call to bring it that early? Well, when you get an opportunity to play in front of such great people as yourself and <laughs> such a great station, well, thank you. you just rise to the occasion. So I'm excited. Well. You literally rise to the occasion <laughs> out of bed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so this is Rochester is your hometown. Yes. How do you like performing in front of? Your people, you know, I've your friends, your family. I've played many places, but there's no, uh, no place like home in Rochester, and that's the good thing about this event. We didn't really go out far to grab uh, acts. We got all our homegrown people here, mm -hmm. some of the best talent that probably haven't been on the big, big stage, but um, we're going to showcase them tonight, and it's going to be a really, really good show. And do Dr. Martin Luther King, uh, King Jr. Park, have you played in that venue before? Yes, this is our second year. It's amazing. It's formerly Manhattan Square Park. Mm -hmm. And um, the city of Rochester have done a wonderful job cleaning up the place and um, making it very comfortable for live music. You know, I moved here almost 13 years ago, and for literally a decade, nothing happened there. And <laughs> you would drive by and I could say, I can totally see how music was once played there. So to bring that, that, that venue back, that has to be so cool. Yes, it's quite amazing. And people really, when they come down and see it, they really have a good time. Mm -hmm. Dancing, grooving. Yes, dancing. <laughs> uh, I just want to say, just come on out tonight. You can bring your uh, chairs and relax. We really want to make it like a festival. So people, you, you come there and you stay and you have a good time enjoying good music and great food. And great weather. Oh, so there's the food, too. Yeah. Food. You cannot beat. Like, I was driving into work this morning, and I'm thinking, this is the mornings that I need to remember, you know, come February. Um, <laughs> and it's these nights, right? Yes. You've got your friends. You've got the food. You've got the weather. And you've got the music, too. The perfect combination for an amazing night. <laughs> so you've already had one event. Yes. Um, how did that go? That went very well. That was our Neo Soul event, and we featured uh, groups like, you know, like uh, Eric Badu, uh, Jill Scott, um, and it went very well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and can you give us a preview for what's coming up this weekend? Ooh, me? Yeah. You want me to just sing something? I don't oh, know. Well, I don't want to put you on the spot. Oh, but. well, we have singers, but I, I sing myself too a little bit. Okay, uh, great. A little bit? Okay. Uh, sure. We put him on the spot. This is the definition Ooh. of on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> I see us in the park, strolling the summer days of imaginings in my head, in words from my heart. Spoke only to the wind, felt even without being said. I don't want to bore you with my trouble. There's something about your love 
that makes me weak and it knocks me off my feet. Woo! 8.30 something in the morning. Did, he wasn't planning on this. Just got off of work. Well done. Thank, Thank you. you. Well done. Well done. <laughs> well done. And then we'll see the, the rest of the group at about uh, 8.50 from yes. now. So come on out tonight. Check it out. You rose to the occasion. <laughs> you rose to the occasion. Well done.